Uh, OK, yeah, as well as can be expected, you know, um, tough couple of days, but uh, getting back into, into camp and around the lads has, has made it a little easier. And Devon was saying yes, you were pretty close to him. Yeah, yeah, very, very close. Um, he was would have been like a father to me, you know, we kind of, um, he lived right around the corner from me and um, my grandmother as well, so we would have well, seen them every single day and um, have great memories with them and uh, yeah, he'll be very, very missed. And what was it like coming back to the squad? What yeah, it was great. You know, they um, they were very quick in coming up to me and and just uh, just saying how sorry they were and how upset um, I must have been. But you know, uh, five minutes later they were making jokes and, and slagging me. So um, uh, yeah, it was just great. They they helped me um, take my mind off the the tougher side of it. Are going to field their best player, Sergio Parise, Kubek as well. He's going to inspire them as well. You know what's coming. It's, it's going to be a brutal physical match, isn't it? Yeah, definitely. It'll be a, it'll be another match up, I reckon. And um, yeah, we'll just have to match them from from the from the very first whistle, and and hopefully we can um, impose our dominance and and right, hopefully come out in the the better end of the scoreboard. And just tell us what the support has been like from back home, because every time we've seen you play, there's been a sea of green in, in the stands. It's been quite inspiring. Yeah, it's been incredible. The fans have been amazing, you know, before kickoffs, watching them gather around the stadium hours before kickoff and things like that. And, and just the atmosphere at the games have been incredible. So um, I think it really hit home with a lot of the lads at the, the Wembley game last week, where it was insane like you couldn't hear each other calling plays and things like that so yeah it's been special and hopefully it continues and i've no doubt it will have you got the squad to go all the way the uh, it's, it is a long i know it's it's everybody seems to say it but it is a long bit away and you'd only trip over yourself if you look that far ahead and we just want to focus on italy because we know what a massive challenge they're going to pose this weekend so if we don't go fully prepared into them we'll leave with eggs on our face so we'll have to focus on italy thanks you mentioned the, the kind of step up in quality. Is there anything that kind of changes in training as you try and go through those extra gears? No, not necessarily. I, I wouldn't think so. Like obviously, um, knowing your opposition before we go into the training pitch is, is a massive part of our preparation. But at the same time, we tend to focus on ourselves and and what we're going to bring to the game and and um, yeah, just control the things we can control and and we'll be alright. <laughs>